Hey guys, this is Michael and I'm with Terra Tundo. This is our Hail Mary episode. We're hoping for a big fish this episode. It's also our last fishing run of the year in 2023. We're gonna start with this jug and we're gonna rebait it with some bluegill. Hopefully there's something sitting on the bottom. Oh damn, you choked that side of a bitch. Huh? Choke them out. Oh yeah. Two shots at it for the damn gar that keeps stealing it. Holla! Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Alright guys, three trial lines. All right, guys, like I said, it is the last fishing run of the year. We got three trot lines out there, and we got that jug we started with, and we will end with it. Fishing for whatever we can catch. What I need you guys to do is comment on the favorite video of the year. Share that video. Uh, there's, I think, 46 at this point. And in November, I'm going to choose so many of those, and those of us on Patreon are going to produce ultimately five videos in December to be voted on for the best video of the year. So if you want to have some type of input, click the like button on that video, comment on it, share it, and uh, in your comment, tell us why you think it's a, your favorite video. You could choose more than one, of course. So as we pass Magic Island here, we're going to uh, check this trot line. You're awful bright and sparkly today. Ah. I like your hairdo. Thank you. Tara had all day to think about this. <laughs> Still was late somehow. I told you. <laughs> I was late actually, but she was late for being late for being late. Yeah, yeah, story of my life. Uh, my son was getting his braces off and I, underestimate it how long it would take four years he had braces four years it's crazy i got a new paddle that's pretty that's a pretty long time huh huh do, how, how long do people usually have them on for i can't hear you how long do people usually have braces on for well four years isn't like out of the ordinary oh my god please be a big motherfucker all right, you got a fish. Yeah, I got a fish. See, put I all bluegill on these lines, guys. Actually, we put some big skipjack too. Oh, I got something. There's a I net right something. behind you. We broke the net last video. You what, broke it? Yeah, it's a new one. It's a little heavier. Oh my God. Oh my God. It's actually the same net. We just put it on a different pole. Yeah, that's a decent blue. Yeah, if this fucker comes off, it'll be sad. All right. Okay. Oh, yeah! Boy! That's a fish of fortune. Yeah. yeah. All right, guys. You should know by now, Fish of Fortune. If she can guess the exact weight, she gets 500 bucks from Hook, Line, and Chill. Paid for by the patrons. She can guess within five pounds underneath the exact weight, she gets $50. If she goes over, she busts and wins nothing. To qualify, it must be 10. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say 16. 
You can't change it. Okay, 16. Which one is it? 16. 13. Okay. At least I wasn't that far off. Like... All right. A 13 pounder. We at least got the skunk out of the boat. So officially we've only got skunked one time this year. Poor That's Caroline. Uh -huh. But it had to happen. We had several videos with just one fish. And I probably have to clarify on our rules, like does a gar count if it's dead? And I'm gonna say no. Really? As far as like it being a, a caught fish to avoid the bucket of water over my head, which is the <laughs> consequence. So uh, we all had a great October, guys. I am tired. I've actually had a little bit of rest uh, with this video. We waited till it got a little colder. I watched the water temperatures. We went bluegill fishing for two days and caught enough bait to bait every hook. Tara was able to find uh, some skipjack in her freezer. Yep. So we cut those up into really large pieces and stuck them on here. And every piece is missing. There's one more hook away over there. I'm sure there's nothing on it, but we're gonna wanna check it. After this, we're gonna be pulling these lines out. And that's it. This line was never the best. Right here in front of Magic Island. As we all know, that's what it's called. Uh, there wasn't much magic on this line. <laughs> So this line was placed on a tree. This tree actually broke off from the top of that sycamore way up there. And it stabbed into the ground right oh my there. God. That's cool. Oh my God. And I wasn't sure if it was gonna stay, but it has. Oh, that's crazy. crash so not gonna crash just be aware i'm gonna go this side this time you know what i mean what are you talking about no i mean there, there is no going on that side no I mean, you're gonna have to pass it off the boat yeah you're right i'm not going to <laughs> All right. okay the last one actually starts from the other side. If that Tara has a side that she likes to start on. I'm actually trying to make it to where the sun is. Uh, I see, I see. Not, not a problem, which this line, it wouldn't matter either way. I feel something somewhere. Feel something. Well, this one pulled up a big one not long ago. He sounds like a monster. You bitch. <laughs> yeah, with Tara's uh, pond, she's got a little pond behind her house, and we caught a lot of bluegill out of it. All the dumb ones. Yeah. <laughs> so we'll be back next year. To... I always say, like, most ponds are good for, like, one or two yeah runs. definitely this one too because it's so tiny yeah it is a small pond yeah <laughs> it's just like we a big probably pulled at least 60 out of it it's just like a more of a big mud puddle pull it up yeah our uh being ripped off continues yeah all right guys we have a line it's been ran once and we were skunked on it I feel like it was set in a pretty good spot. Okay, oh, pray for me. A little dusty in the air. Corn dusty. Corn. 
13 hooks here. We did change some hooks and we moved this line down about 10 feet on the other side. It was hanging up on something. What? It, it was hanging on oh. something. shadows. There's not enough current to get this boat to move down river yeah. at all. River has been as low as it possibly can this year for a long time, way too long. I'm becoming one of those old guys when it Ugh. rains. We needed it. <laughs> we needed it, guys. <laughs> Well, we did. Feel anything? I don't know. Pick something somewhere. Unless it's just, I don't know. No, there is something somewhere. Uh -huh. There, there better be. Huh? There better be. Oh, yeah, here's something. Yeah. Well, I'm something. Check it out. Let me check it out. Don't let him play. Do it. It's not in his fucking mouth. <laughs> Decent channel cap. I always it. let the last fish go, you know. <laughs> the last run of the year is sacrificial back to the Green River. Now let's hope there's a giant one over there, though. Let's hope. Let's. I'm hoping. Hope. Hoping and praying and wishing. <sighs> But we've been up and down this river, mostly upriver this year, guys. 95% yeah. upriver. Last year we were downriver. We definitely caught bigger fish downriver. Like I've said in another video, uh, I saw some hoop nets upriver. And I don't think they could catch them all, but maybe that's why we didn't get it, hold of any monsters up there. They're all over this river. Oh, something, another something. You got something? Another something. Does it feel big? I don't know, I can't tell. I cannot tell. Oh, it looks pretty decent, yeah. Oh. Not too long, but you know. Potentially the last fish of the year, guys. And that is a nice, pretty looking flatty. A small flatty. A pickle. Nice little pickle. Pickle puff. Oh, pickle puff. You can get it out? Yeah. And hold it up. Come on, fucker. Hold that giant. I don't know. This is pretty yellow. You know, there's a lot of yellow in this one. Yeah, he's a nice one. Return that one to the Green River. Okay. Maybe next year Fuck it'll out. be yeah. 40 pounder. Maybe. <laughs> Not looking good. No, no. One is still on. All right, guys. That was our last hook. We've had so many people. November, we will try to do some highlight reels. Like I said, in December, we'll be doing our boats and our award announcements. Uh, in uh, November, I'll be uh, figuring all that out. We're going to pick a charity for all the money that we've raised per fish. Uh, we did pretty good this year, and there's a lot of people that say they're going to match or they're going to add this and that, so appreciate that. we got a lot more videos to come, but this is our last fishing video. I started the year with Tara.
she showed up for my intro video and I'll end it with Tara. So this is Michael with Tara Tundo and we'll see y'all off and on for the next couple months. Bye. <laughs> Thank you.